Hi, Bruce from Safari. What we're looking at here is our Jupiter wall kit. We're gonna take the cover off in a minute, but you can see there, it's uh, very discreet. You imagine that up against the wall there. It's uh, between 550, 600 high, and it's about 420 wide. Um, let's take the cover off and have a look underneath. Wow, look at that. And so what we have in here are two examples of our digital switching. Uh, we've got a star light at the top. I'm just zooming in on it. And that's 12 channels at 10 amps and it's dimmable and you can run RGBW lights. We've got star power here. It's got six in the middle there at 30 amps and six more at 10 amps. That's a total of 150 that it can run. And we've got these Wago blocks over here and the leads out of the star power and the star light go in. All they've got to do is put the positive at the top, negative at the bottom, whatever they're gonna switch, they're matched and bingo, uh, card on the side here with what you're turning on and off, very easy to do. So we've got a new CAN keypad we're introducing. That's the 12 button one. You can see you can pop out the icons, you can rotate them around, pop in your own icon. So you don't need to do the custom engraving. It's CAN on the back, it's IP65, 66, and it's got a beautiful push button on it and backlit. And then and here's our wireless keypad. It's flat, goes against the wall. And uh, that keypad there in the white version, we can comfortably engrave. The black is a little bit harder to engrave. And you can have up to six points of switching um, on any one output. We've got manual switching here on the uh, star power. You can see the red LED light comes on. And then if we go over to our display, I've configured this first one as main light. When I turn that on, I can dim. And that's the first channel up on star light here that we've just turned on, turn off. Uh, we do have our star tank on here, no tank senders in here. We also have monitoring of Victron in here that you can see the percentages. Everything coming out of the Victron turbo there is coming in. And we also have uh, power devices that you can configure. And then right on the front page here, we've got four modes that can be configured on it as well. That's totally wireless and run on 12 volt on a holder, that magnetic holder that comes underneath. We've got the RCBOs built in here to make it a neat package. How good's that? 